passive stretching for the upper extremity. If we're doing the shoulder, we want to stabilize the scapula. Use the heel of the hand on the edge of the scapula for shoulder flexion, abduction. So hold that in place and then apply your pressure. Okay. For internal external rotation, still stabilizing the scapula, but we're going to do it with the forearm over the anterior shoulder so that as that tries to pop up, we control it. Moving down the upper extremity for the elbow, small pillow or roll underneath there. Stabilize the top, careful of how much force and pressure we put on the elbow. Pronation, supination is this passive range of motion with a plus. Same thing for wrist flexion, extension, radial and ulnar deviation. Our same technique, stabilize, passive range of motion, engage the barrier with a plus. Doing the digits, digits have to be done individually. If they need to be stretched, we have to individually stretch each joint, each finger, and the thumb. And don't forget the little web space. Good? All right.